spirit of Lincoln as a Republican, renounced the party. He wanted to support Nelson Rockefeller, the former governor of New York. Right. And, and in your book, that seems like a pivotal moment that is reshaping the trajectory of the Republican Party and its relationship with African Americans. Absolutely. So it's a, it's a watershed moment, uh, not just for Jackie Robinson, who is this figure that we know um, is highly political. So we know him for his baseball career and his sports career and for being groundbreaking in that way. But he's also very active in, uh, in politics. So it's a groundbreaking moment for him, watershed moment. But it's also a watershed moment for black people in the Republican Party more broadly, because it forces them to speak openly and um, very aggressively about their position on civil rights. It forces them to take a side. Um, and part of that is because the party is moving in a direction that many of them do not feel comfortable with. Many, many, many of them do not feel comfortable with this. In fact, they go back and forth in 1964 at the Cow Palace as Barry Goldwater is being nominated with uh, uh, staging a walkout, what they call a blackout. Uh, they talk about maybe we should stay within the party. And I think Jackie Robinson is instrumental in really organizing these people into a group that then becomes an oppositional force within the party to Goldwater forces. You know, Jackie Robinson says, there's no room in the party for racists and there are no, there's no room in the party for conservative Goldwater Republicans. And they're adamant about that. 